Hey folks, Michael Daniels here with Tinkering with Tech. Today we're going to talk about Google Chat, which is to replace Hangouts. We're also going to talk about the progressive web app. Check this out. So we're going to talk about the Google Chat app, which will be replacing Hangouts. Here's the old Hangouts. You go to hangouts.google.com. When I type in chat.google.com, it immediately takes me right here to this open window. And then you can see on mine, it actually has a menu here, try the chat desktop app. This is where they're talking about the progressive web app. It's not an extension, but it's similar to an extension. I don't know how to explain it because I'm not an engineer, but this is what you would do. And you can click on install and add that app. Let's learn how to add the chat progressive web app. First of all, you have to be in chat.google.com. You must be here. It will not work unless you're on chat.google.com. Once you're there, then we need to click the three dots in Chrome in this same window, and you will see a choice for install Google Chat. So we're going to click that. Once we click that, then the install app comes up, and then you just install it. Now it's a freestanding progressive web app that you can use. Once you install it, you can see right here, this is what the chat menu looks like. It's a free floating, it's very plain, very simple. You can see where you have people at the top and then rooms at the bottom. You have the chat section, then you have rooms. In comparison, I'm going to show you on the progressive web app right now, you can see you can only join chats and rooms that you are invited. So I can't add a chat and I can't add any rooms. But if you look on the web version, you can see the plus sign to start a chat with someone and also to start, create or find a room. So you do have this option on the web, just not on the progressive web app as of right now. On the web version, you can see how I've minimized the chat and the rooms and meet. I've minimized all those so I can expand those and open those up all I want on the web version. And as you can see over here, you don't see those same choices on the progressive web app. You cannot shrink those down. In comparison to Hangouts, you can see there are some differences. One thing that you do have with the chat app in the browser, you can see the side menu bar that gives you the same thing when you're inside Gmail and calendar and other Google products. When I click the three dots next to someone's name, you can see it has the same exact thing on the web version and the progressive web app. And what I'm talking about is these three dots next to the names here. One other thing you cannot do with the progressive web app is to pop these conversations out. You can see right here, I can pop this conversation out. If I wanna take this room, I can pop this out. So you can have these all down here organized and running through that you can use and see you can shrink them down you can exit them doesn't remove them doesn't take you out of the group but it removes it out of this main area and like the individual chat up above you have the rooms where you can pin notifications for all new messages uh, leave if you wanted to leave and block and report Keep in mind, this is the same chat and rooms that you see the web version in Gmail. This is my Gmail account. If I go down to chat, you can see the chat messages that I have and you can see the room. I can expand both of those. Again, you can add a new room and you can add a new chat. The three dots, same things as the web version of chat only. I'm going to switch tabs so you can kind of see that they're the same only it doesn't have your Gmail there we go so all of these are the same as the browser version 
When I type in chat.google.com, it directs me right here, and this is how I get to this window. So you can see it's loading chat and all of the usual things that we just saw. So Hangouts will be going away. Some of you have the Hangout extension. The Hangout extension will be going away. And the Progressive Web App for chat will be coming in. So this is chat versus Hangouts. I hope this helped you out. If it did, be sure to subscribe to the channel and also check out a couple of these other two videos that I got over here on something similar. Thank you very much.